Yo! What's up, y'all? I am here with Virtual Fighter 5 Ultimate Showdown. Now, this is the remastered version of the 2006 game, Virtual Fighter 5. This game just came out, and it's looking pretty fire so far. So, we got all the OG characters here. We got Akira Yuki. We got Pai Chan. We got Lao Chan. We got Wolf Hawkfield. I think I remember him. We got Jeffrey McWild. I probably remember him too. We got this ninja person, bro. We got Cage Maru. We got Sarah Bryant. We got Jackie Bryant. We got Shundi or Shundai. I can't pronounce that because there's so many ways to pronounce that actually. Am I lying? Lion or Raphael? Oh, Raphael or Raphael? Ayo, Aoi Umeno Koji. Oh my god. Leife, Leife. <laughs> These names are not that hard to pronounce, trust me. Vanessa Lewis. Brad Burns. Go Hinogami Oh El Blaze I wanna say sumo wrestler so bad but he's not even a sumo wrestler. I only she looks like a beginning character, not even gonna lie. And now he's the sumo wrestler, yeah him. Taka Arashi And I've got this dude, Gene Kujo. I think I remember him. And this actually looks like um those Extra behind world news people, you know, with the world globe. It says do 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 do, ABC 12, 10, whatever news. Virtual Fighter 5 Ultimate Showdown. Anyways, what is going on, guys? It is Young Children's Entertainment. I'm back with another video. And today, guys, I'm here with Virtual Fighter 5 Ultimate Showdown. Now, I was super excited for this game to come out because this game reminds me of games like Tekken and Street Fighter, just those OG fighting games, and this is from Sega, as you can see at the bottom, the copyright. And this is a classic, including many other games, but this is the remastered version, like I said in the beginning of the video. And yeah, nothing else to say, so let's get started. Okay, y'all, so I'm in the lobby. This reminds me so much of WWE 2K19. Maybe 2K20, but I played the 2K19 version, it was super good. So we got ranked matches, room matches, training, arcade, and offline versus. And since arcade is just CPUs and I want to practice before I start playing against people, I'll just stick with that for now. And there's also a screen, as you guys can see, where you can watch actual other people play this game, which is kind of cool. Because you can see the color and the outfit's different. It's just not, it's not just CPUs playing. But I'm going to configure my settings and look over the controls really quickly, so I'll be right back with that. I am back. I got a round set up with CPUs. And I actually named Li Fei for right now. That's how you pronounce his name, I'm pretty sure, Li Fei. And as my second man, I use Ai Umeno Koji. And yeah, about to get this started. I'm not sure how many rounds there are. I mean, there's three rounds, but I'm not sure how many opponents there are. And normal health and everything. I also customized my card and stuff. And there's seven rounds, and I'm going against Go Hinogami first. Broken house, breakable, full fence, 12 by 12. That's why I remember this game. Just the details they put into describing the circle. Yeah, not the circle, the arena. It's usually square. But yeah, he looks really intimidating. But since it's the first round, he shouldn't be too hard. So let me see. Okay. So yeah. I only scammed through the controls, but... I'm really beating this man up. I just started. It's only been 10 seconds, and I'm about to win the match. 11 seconds, I just won the match. Imagine that. You can do a lot of combos in this game. Ooh. Okay. I have to get used to not pressing square that much, because square is to block, actually, and I might mess up with that a lot. I'm not even going to lie. I think that's my lot of time just for the first stage at the bottom. Wow, bro. It took me 17 seconds. I, mean, I know it's the first round, but this is just too easy. Now, obviously, it might get harder and harder, but 
I need to get used to the tilting camera angle because even though it's a 2D game, it has 3D angles where you can turn around. Which is the cool factor about this game. Ooh. Combo the mess out of him though. Bro, look at that face, bro. He looked like Kansai from World's End Club. By the way, that's the game that just came out from the creators of Danganronpa and Zero, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure it's the same creative director. I forgot that man's name. I used to know his name. Oh, dang. Dang. Oh, I mean, since he's fat, he might be sore, but he might do a lot of damage, so I'm not sure how that works. But yeah, getting people's damage on this game is so easy. Ooh. Okay, he bodied me a little bit. Hit him with the one, two. Kick him and all that stuff, yeah. Oh, I'm about to hit him off the ring. Oh, why am I pressing square again? Man, I have slide sweep, sweep slide, whatever it's called. It's slide kick his feet or whatever. This big donut roll tie. Oh, I'm about to really hit him off this time. Let's go. Ring out. Three wins. But look at this man's face, hold on. He's like, what did I do? This old barbaric monkey looking at my arm, bro. But my character's face is ugly. Just his facial expression. I'm going against Cage Maru. Hagakure Ryo Jujutsu. Jujutsu. Yeah. Also, they do have different fighting styles, I'm guessing. And he looks like a Rambo from Mortal Kombat when he does that stuff. Oh my god. Cause this ninja not playing. Ooh, okay. Man, this man is almost done in 11 seconds. Yeah, it's 11 seconds. Boom. Okay, this shouldn't take too long, but I really hope I don't go against super hard people. Because if I lose one match, I might just skip over to the match I win, too. But I shouldn't be worried about that right now. Okay, 15 seconds. I still hit him while he's on the ground. Okay. Okay. Ooh, okay. Yeah, one thing I don't really use in this game that is super important is directional pads. Well, directional arrows, because you could jump more. You do a more of a variety of attacks if you use those. I lean. Okay, bet. But yo, Eileen is so short, actually. I'm not even gonna lie. When I first saw her in the intro. And she sounds so... She sounds so girl... Look how short this girl is. She's like at least an inch shorter than me. Oh, dang. She's actually getting me pretty low. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, she's blocking a lot, but she's so short that she's so fast. When I try to hit her, nothing really works out. Okay, first round I just closed. So that's the lowest I've gotten. So far, she's the hardest opponent. By performance-wise. Oh, I think it's saying this time I spent on this game. I don't think I... No, yeah, I think it's just my allotted time. So, two minutes? How'd I beat four people in two minutes? Ooh! Bang her against that fence. Like just body her to the ground. Bro, like Brock when he got bodied by Cindy. Or Misty, not Cindy, Misty. And this music slaps. That's how I'm keeping it on. Usually, if the music's too loud because you can't hear me, just turn it down or something, but this actually kind of slaps. I also have an 80k theme for my PlayStation. The music hits. 80k is one of the most legendary game companies ever. They're right behind Sega, but they're actually kind of underrated, to be honest. You know, they're pretty legendary. And I just beat Eileen, so let's get it. 
I don't even know what this man is saying, but Vanessa Lewis, she looks scary. And she was veiled too, though. But the waterfall's looking nice. It looks like the, um, what is it called? I forgot what the game was called. It's that game where you run from that big, ugly gorilla. Temple Run, yeah. That looks like a Temple Run type map. And she's blocking a lot. I just realized that. Okay, and yeah, that's the camera angles turning. I hate that, actually. She's kind of comboing me, so... She might be the second artist, actually. Ooh, and I don't actually don't know how to cancel those out. Like, a reversal. And she just knocked me out. First knockout. Like, what? She's so lucky. Okay. You try a bit harder then. See, so look, I need to know, learn how to cancel those out. Being honest. Okay, I'm trying to kick her, but she keeps on doing those moves. It's like, um, not fatal blows. It's like crushing blows. I'm pretty sure they're calling Mortal Kombat. Look at this. Oh my god. It's just so annoying. I don't know who's it calling me in the middle of recording, bro. Must be some spam number, but oh my god. Dang, bro, I'm actually getting B. She won the match. No way. I was kicking this girl, but she blocks all the time. That's the first match I lost. You know what? I don't quit in these games, bro. I'm continuing. That's for sure. I feel like they have continued because of the arcade games. I mean, not just arcade games, but that just shows, you know, the og Because if you've been to, like, Dave & Bust or something, the machines, they have to actually to continue. It's just been a common video game thing on arcade machines. I already get body right off the bat, okay. Ooh, okay, okay. Hit it with the combo. Oh my god, this camera angle's turning, twisting, doing all types of stuff. Okay, okay, I'm kicking her, okay. And I actually have a video coming up. But I'm gonna release this for a sense. I'm doing this on the second or the third. Let me check. Yeah, I'm doing this on the second. So I might just upload it... Same day, or I might upload it tomorrow on the third. Yeah, I'm gonna just upload this on the third. Why not? So you guys will be seeing this because this is the second me, well June second me. It's most likely going up June third. I also have a Rocket League video soon, and also have a Rec Room video because I haven't played Rec Room in forever. Well, two Rec Room videos. One of them I haven't really focused on, so made it a long time ago. Never uploaded it. But my second video I just made on the first, or on Memorial Day, so that's going up soon. So we got this game, Rocket League, and Memorial, well, not Memorial Day, Rec Room. So two to one, let's go on beating her, but she still got a round off of me. She's definitely harder than most of these, so that's why I gotta start trying. Okay, okay, okay. Nah, bro, Can I, I wanna do that so flawlessly, but look how she just... Grab my leg. And look, it gives you an opportunity to cancel it out, but I don't know how to. I'm not going into my settings. Just fighting like a real warrior. Oh, thank you. I'm going 3-1, though. And what the heck, bro? Lana Rhodes is pregnant. One minute ago by Draw Muller. That's what I'm talking about. What the heck? I don't even know. And, oh my god, this is Kujo. Yeah, Kujo's also scary. I thought Vanessa was scary. And since you could ape, mm, I don't know. I'm pretty sure you could break the fences. Yeah, they said it was breakable. But since these are like pure metal, these are most likely rotatable ones. For every round, it just rotates for um with a cage or without a cage. It's actually the training room. Looks pretty nice. You no, know, it's really metallic. Ooh, he was just about to punch me and I just kicked him in his face. 
I saw him back in up getting ready. See, look, it is rotatable. Okay, I'm gonna try to get, hit him off. Oh, no, no. I'm getting bodied a little bit. Oh, oh my god. Just Falcon punched me. And I Falcon punched him. Oh, why am I. I keep on pressing square. No, I'm pressing square. He's blocking. No. In this game, it's like it's not. It's super different from Mortal Kombat. If someone blocks, you have to keep on blocking, and you might have an opportunity to hit them while they're blocking. But this game, once you mess up your opportunity to get a good combo, they could hit you, kill you easily. Let me see this. Okay, he's low. Come on now, he's super low. No, he just backhand slapped me with his hand or his elbow. Which one? Yeah, what if his elbow? Oh my god. Okay, I keep on doing the same combos, so I think these AIs are smart. And I keep on pressing square, and I keep on getting comboed, my god. Ooh, okay, jumped on top of him. Yeah, I don't use my R2, L2, L1, R1, which is another disadvantage for me. I should use those more, but those are like more grab commands, like Mortal Kombat. You have to get it at the right moment, or you could just get bodied, and it looks like you look stupid, basically. Mm. And I actually played Zone 4 before. This kind of reminds me of Zone 4 also. Well, I already mentioned, yeah, I mentioned that, but... Just like the art style. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> He's so low. If he didn't block that kick, I could have easily got a punch combo on him. But I'm not giving up. Oh, he's the second to last person. I wasn't even paying attention. Well, I just said I was going to skip over it, so... I'll see you guys when I win, okay? What's up, y'all? It's Future YCD. Just got done saying that I was going to wait till, you know, I won a match. I looked over the recording, and something special happened this next match. So, just wanted to let you guys know that. Jean Kujo. I hope I can win this match. Honestly, because... Okay, I hit him with the combo. Yeah, I want to win this match because the last round I just got beat by this man. I straight up annihilated. Okay, so we're around the same health. Oh, hit him. Okay, kick. This man blocks a lot. It's like Vanessa. Ooh, this guy got the jump kick on him. Pfft, got bodied. Oh, dang, he backed up on me. Got a lucky shot and I'm still beating him up. Well, now he's beating me up, and he's super high health, but hold on. Hit him. I keep on forgetting square is not... No, he dirty for that. I keep on forgetting square is not, um... Yeah, square is not punching, but... He just had to hit land that last jump kick on me. Oh my god, okay. Um... Man, I keep on doing that. And he keeps on crouching, uh... Oh my god. So it's a one to two. I still have a chance, but he cannot win this round or I lose. Oh. Oh my god. Hold on. Oh, I could have got the. Oh, if I would have hit his leg. He keeps on blocking. Stop blocking. Come on, Gene. Oh, jump kick him. Hey, Gene, come on. Oh, no, no, no. It's getting chip damage off of me, kind of. Wait. Wait, wait. Ooh. Tried to stomp on me and I slid his leg. Let's get it. Okay. Hold on, he getting hit, he getting hit, okay. Hit a little combo and he, oh my god, he dodged a kick and he hit me in my stomach, wow. Okay, oh my god, bro, I'm so low. Bro, these camera angles, okay. Hit his legs again. Back up. Play it safe a bit. Oh. Come on. Come on. Okay, he's one shot. He's one shot. Oh my god, I'm one health. One health. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my god, bro. Yo, I was one sliver left of dying and I still won, bro. That's how I know you suck, Jin Kucho. Oh my god, bro. Final stage, Akira Yuki. This is going to be crazy.
I can tell. What's up y'all, it's Future YCD. Since this took me a long time, the first clip you're going to see is the original intro when I first fought him. The second time was a very special match that something crazy happened, and the third time is the me winning. Yo, okay, the music and the map's looking pretty fine. Akira Yuki versus Leafe. Let's get it started. Okay, got a few hits on him. Okay, whoa, whoa. Okay, I don't know what that red and green joystick means. I do need to learn that. Oh my god, keep on pressing square. And he's ducking every time I try to jump kick. Yo, he was like halfway. Or around halfway. So stupid. Okay. Try to hit me. Got a few hits on him and his switching camera angle is so annoying. Okay, he's getting these blocks on me. And he's getting a little kick chip damage, whatever it's called. Oh my god. Okay, he's one shot, he's one shot. Come on. No, oh, he's doing flawless blocks. Thank you. Okay, I see what gets legs. Ooh, okay. He's backing up a bit. Oh, he's behind me. Hitting. Man, this is crazy because I want to at least try to win first round. Well, at least I wish I would have had because I don't even know what to say. I'm just disappointed. I have to actually go through this man a lot of times, so that's why I'm just saying. He still KO'd me somehow. But yeah, he is a hard boss. I can't even lie. You're going to have to practice a bit if you're going to go against him. God, oh my god. He's one shot. He's one sliver. One sliver. No. I'm done with this game. I'm about to play one more match. If I lose this one match because of something stupid like that one sliver of health he had somehow beating me in a combo, I'm done with this game. Okay, y'all. This is the final round. I've gone against this man too many times and I keep on losing. That last round, I was so close to hitting him, but nah, bro. He just had to get that combo on me. Okay, so I got a few kicks on him halfway through. But, you know, I'm just still upset about all these rounds. It took forever. I'm starting to use my D-pad arrows, R1, L1, L2, and R2 more. That type of stuff. Okay, got him. Let me see this. Okay, hit him with the 1-2. Okay, hit him again. Ooh. I'm being more careful now. I said these changing angles, bro. These interchanging 3D angles. Look at this. Look, 13 minutes. I spent 13 minutes on this. The last ones took like two minutes for like all the rounds. Some of them took like five minutes, but yo, 13 minutes. And look how he bodied me. Like, I've never seen anybody get bodied like that before. Oh my god. It's one to one, so I can't be too worried. And he crouches off the bat. Okay, okay, okay. Do you not bully me like that? Come on, I'm trying to get a long combo on this dude. So I need to practice. Yeah, next episode, 100% practice. Thing. Ain't no way. So I need to learn how to do reversals. Look, I could have hit that man, but then he flew on the other side of the screen, bro. Hmm. Okay, okay, oh, I kind of dodged it a bit, but oh, he's so low, he's low. Ooh, yeah, now I'm really using it now. And I see how people punch, like that one dude did, except he did it with his feet, he did a roll. Thank you. Finally, so I want to see if there's anything else included in this. Bonus stage with Doral, or, yeah, that's Doral, I thought that was Doral. Oh, this is like a testing stage. Bro, <laughs> what is this? I'm not sure during the previous things, because I don't remember this person. But they tall. Okay. Whoa, okay, whoa, whoa. Just help me. Okay, 
trying to kick me in my face and everything, bro. Oh my god, I'm getting body. Why do you keep on crouching like that, bro? Yo, I'm, I have to, I'm trying to do jump attacks, but if I try to do jump attacks, I'm pretty sure they're going to kick me in my face. Like, what? <sighs> Let me see this. Come on. Bro, stop dry humping me. Yo, now they're on the ground. Oh my god. Look. Look at this. Now I don't even want to get up and start fighting. Make no sense. Oh my god, I'm one health. Come on, come on. Come on. No, I couldn't even kick their legs, bro. Like, what is this? Who is Dural, bro? What is Dural, bro? Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm sorry to get embodied in my face. Come on now. Third dry hump or fourth dry hump within. I don't even know. Yo, stop comboing me. I can't even get up and hit you. Yeah, I need to do a reversal for that or something. I don't know how to break out of that. Cause it gives you time to break out of it. Oh my god. Let me see if I can try to do it again if I can. Unfortunately, I can't go against Dural again unless I most likely go through all seven of the characters again throughout the list. And also, um, past this, it's just credits, so you can skip over it.
Game over! No way, it's actually game over. Why is this game over music kind of slap? What the heck? It should not be slapping like this. But anyways, guys, this is the end of the video. Thank you guys for watching. Wow, this was crazy. I had fun playing against the CPUs, but I want to go against the Rowl again and practice my skills. And next episode, I do want to go against some online people, as you guys can see again on screen. And it looks actually good. You know, this remaster version is very good. The graphics are a bit different, you know, with the shading and everything. Not for the maps I played, kind of, but for certain maps. Since they were getting, they're trying to make a game that was not low on gigabytes, so they did some setting changes. And there's not a lot of features, but the game was still fun nonetheless. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you like, subscribe, and turn notifications for episode 2, since this game was super fun. I just can't stop saying that. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.